Hello and welcome to Kentucky Brew Reviews. I'm Radar. Special K, and tonight we're doing <clears throat> Captain Morgan Sliced Apple. It is uh, an apple-flavored rum. Uh, it is a premium rum with natural apple flavors, spices, and other flavors. Uh, it is 35% alcohol by volume, uh, or 70 proof. Brand new Captain Morgan type rum. Yeah, it just came out. Very so, important. price was $15, and they had a $3 off coupon on the bottle. Hey, oh, one of those that just like hangs off the neck. Yeah. Yeah. So Good I got choice. 12 bucks. Good catch. Good 12 catch. bucks. Wow, that, I can smell the apples from here. Mm -hmm. That smells like uh, apple that butter. smells like green apple, just mmm. Uh, yeah, it's very green apple-y. Uh, it's not quite Jolly Rancher. Blow pop. Jolly Rancher's like a, yeah, maybe like, like a blow pop. pop. Yeah. yeah. Hint of rum on the back end. Yeah, it smells nice. Uh, it I, I think it it smells very sweet. Rum and apple goes good together, so that's a good choice. Yeah, take taste. Not too sweet. Mm-hmm. Nice apple up front. A little bit of bite throughout. Mm -hmm. You don't get a lot of spice from the rum, per se. It's just a lot of apple flavor up front. Yeah, yeah. I think that would be, I think that would be a good shooter. You could, you could sit and take shots of that. Chilled, for sure. Yeah. Uh, there's nothing super special about this. I disagree. There's not any other apple flavored rums out there. I mean, I was, you know what? I guess that's true. That is kind of, that makes it kind of a flavor. That was fake green, yeah. neon green. And that was right. that was the cannon blast. That was a pre-made shot thing. Yeah, this is definitely. Uh, that I, was a lower I, I still think too. that was a that was a pretty interesting drink. Yeah. Um, I think this is this is solidly in like the seven range. Uh, uh, for sure. I'm gonna go with the seven and a half. I think it's really good for what it is. Hmm. Um, I'd like a slightly more. Uh, actual rum flavor in the background, but I mean that's to its key demographic, and also because it's freaking twelve dollars, I think that's fine. I think that's uh, that yeah. really that apple that apple aftertaste is really nice. That was a good choice. Mix it with Coke because rum and Coke. That's what you do with Coke. Yeah, and rum. Take a nose. Mostly what you do with Coke. Apple. Caramel. Yeah, it just Caramel apple. it just it just still smells like mostly apple. Caramel apple. Caramel in this though, yeah. Now it does definitely taste like a caramel apple. I wonder how this would be with like just a little pinch of salt in it. Yeah, uh, it is very caramel apple-y. The Coke does does good for it. It makes what little bit of harshness it had go away. Mm -hmm. um, it's an easy drinker for yeah. sure. This doesn't taste alcoholic anymore. <laughs> if you're a rum guy, you're looking for something, an easy drinker for the night that yeah. has a pretty good proof, this is absolutely it. That'll Especially do, if that'll you do it for you. Something that's pretty versatile because this would be a good mixer, it would be a good shooter. Um, it'd go in a lot of different directions. Mm -hmm. um, I'd even sip it. I know some people frown upon that, but I'd sip on this with a few ice cubes. I don't know if I could. Yeah, with a few ice cubes, that'd be all right. Chill it down. Give it a little bit of water. Uh, uh, I, don't know if I, I don't know how I feel about sipping it, though. Go ahead, uh, sorry. Seven. Uh, seven. Seven and a half. Uh, seven and a half as a mixer. I think it's worth a seven as a mixer. I think it's... I, I still think it's good. It, it's... It's, it's very nice. Um, yeah, I'm curious about this because they came out briefly before this. They came out with their orange cream before this. We, we had a bottle, but uh, <laughs> Catfish took it. We never got a chance to actually review it. Uh, apparently, it was pretty good. It got disappeared. Yeah, I'm curious if they're going to do, do other flavors. But for the price, man, like I said, you can't beat 12 bucks for a bottle like this. I'm sure it was introductory price, and I'm sure most places aren't oh, going to yeah. get it as cheap. As, as we can get it, just because, you know, this is Kentucky. Either and, that, or it was a manufacturer's coupon, and literally everyone is going to have it for $12 for, like, the next six months. Nutritional facts. Uh, 100, really? 100 calories per shot. I mean, that's that's really not all that It's bad. only 3.7 carbs. 3.7 carbs, bro. <laughs> well, I mean, it's, it's, it's liquor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Liquor's not super high on the uh, nutritional... Uh, volume. You can live off liquor. It's fine. Beer. Alright, well, that's been our episode. If there's something you'd like to see on the channel, you leave a comment down below. <laughs> Don't forget to hit that like button. I'm Special K. And I'm Radar. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.